Good morning, it's Tuesday and it's time for our devotion. Our scripture this morning is Psalm 89. It's a little longer than our usual passage, so I'll go right into it. I will sing of the Lord's loyal love forever. I will proclaim your faithfulness with my own mouth from one generation to the next. That's why I say your loyal love is rightly built forever. You establish your faithfulness in heaven you said, I made a covenant with my chosen one. I promised my servant David, I will establish your offspring forever. I will build up your throne from one generation to the next. Salah. Heaven thanks you for your wondrous acts, Lord, for your faithfulness too in the assembly of the holy ones. Is there any in the sky who could compare to the Lord? Who among the gods is equal to the Lord? God is respected in the council of the holy ones. God is awesome and revered more than all those around him. Who is like you, Lord, God of heavenly forces? Mighty Lord, your faithfulness surrounds you. You rule over the surging sea. When its waves rise up, it's you who makes them still. It's you who crushed Rahab like a dead body. You scattered your enemies with your strong arm. Heaven is yours, the earth too, the world and all that fills it. You made all of it, north and south, you created them. The mountains, Tabor and Hermon, shout praises to your name. You have a powerful arm, your hand is strong, your strong hand is raised high. Your throne is built on righteousness and justice, loyal love and faithfulness stand in front of you. The people who know the celebratory shout are truly happy. They walk in the light of your presence, Lord. They rejoice in your name all day long and are uplifted by your righteousness. Because you are the splendor of their strength, by your favor you make us strong. Because our shield is the Lord's own, our king belongs to the Holy One of Israel. Once you spoke in a vision to your faithful servants. I placed a crown on a strong man. I raised up someone specially chosen from the people I discovered, my servant David. I anointed him with my holy, holy oil. My hand will sustain him. Yes, my arm will strengthen him. No enemy will oppress him. No wicked person will make him suffer. I will crush all his foes in front of him. I will strike down all those who hate him. My faithfulness and my loyal love will be with him. He will be strengthened by my name. I will set his hand on the sea. I will set his strong hand on the rivers. He will cry out to me, You are my Father, my God, the rock of my salvation. Hope is a candle once lit by the prophets, never consumed though it burns through the years. Dim in the daylight of power and privilege when they are gone, hope will shine on. Peace is a candle to show us a pathway threatened by gusts from our rage and our greed. Friend, feel no envy for those in the shadows, violence and force, they're dead and coarse. Love is a candle whose light makes a circle, where every face is the face of a friend. Widen the circle by sharing and giving, God's holy dare, love everywhere. Joy is a candle of mystery and laughter, mystery of light that is born in the dark. Laughter at hearing the voice of an angel ever so near, casting out fear. Christ is the light that the prophets awaited. Christ is the lion, the lamb, and the child. Christ is the love and the mystery and laughter. Candles make way. Christ is the day.